Greetings, child. I've met few aside from goblins here. Ah, are you also here to assist with the prisoner? Please. The things they do to that man. So crude and primitive. I was invited to teach them. I live for pain and its intricacies, you see. But, alas. Pain without purpose is a terrible thing. Wouldn't you agree? I realize this looks strange, but I assure you, it is a most intimate form of worship. You see, pain is a loving thing, but trying to explain it to these goblins has proven. Forgive me, but that look in your eyes, something terrible has happened to you. Because I see those same eyes when I look in the mirror, dear one. We've all suffered in these dark times. It is little wonder you bear scars of pain and anguish. Please, let me alleviate this pain. As the Maiden of Pain, the Goddess Loviata teaches us, through penance, administered by my skilled hand. My work can grant peace and serenity, the likes of which few experience. It will be worth it. I promise. Mm, I must see this. Don't you dare say no. Oh, I have something exquisite in mind. Both Loviata and I are interested in how you handle pain, dear one. And should you delight her, you will most assuredly receive her most gracious blessing. Trust me. Simply face the wall and we can begin. Face the wall and let us begin, dear one. Yes, this will do nicely. The pain you suffer will cleanse you. Do not fight it. joined up with him if you'd known he'd be indulging in this sort of thing, Astarian. I mean, I had my hopes. <laughs> wonderful! Just wonderful! Wonderful. You want more? I'll give it to you. My, my. Who knew our friend had so much blood in them? Try not to lick your lips as you say that. Good. Turn to 
towards the wall. Ah! That's it! Welcome the pain! Let it become part of you. That's a promise, dear one. Sweet child, you bore the pain like a true believer. I could feel Oviatar's pleasure with every sting of my scourge. I am proud to have served you this penance. Interesting is an understatement, dear one. Loviata herself found your performance inspiring. She has deemed you worthy of her blessing. Personal note. Thank you. That was positively divine. Don't go bothering my pigeon. He's mine. Um, Peach. Keep him safe. Listen to him coo. Till I get hungry or some such. What's it to ya? Then catch one on your own! As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. for a joke, why don't ya? And don't let the lads snatch him up. No telling what they'll do to him. Bring him back when he's all tuckered out. Here's the key. Pigeon's all yours. joy to see a familiar face in such a precarious setting. I guarantee the story of your daring rescue of my person will live on for eons. I intend to do just that. A trusty invisibility potion goes a long way in a place like this. <laughs> we mustn't tarry, but I hate for our friendship to end here. Please, won't you meet me once we've both slipped the goblin yoke? Why, by design, my friend. How better to learn the ways of a people than to live among them? I dare say the experiment has proven most fruitful, too. I'd be happy to share my findings once we've found somewhere safe to parley. Smashing! Soon, my friend. Soon we can share the flagon of something liquid and a tale of daring do. I'll slip away when the coast is clear. See you soon, my friend. I simply can't wait to pick your brain! Your scouting party has not returned, and half of the intruders escaped your guards. Sorry, mistress. We mucked up. Until their sanctuary is found. 
I will take something precious from you every hour that passes. A trinket, a tongue, a limb. Ain't no use without my limbs. The lads will make the prisoner squeal soon enough, I swear. Silence now, creature, or I will silence you forever. As she turns to you, her thoughts mingle with yours. A cold hand caressing your brain. The chamber melts away to reveal a dark, endless nowhere. In it, you see a vision. The drow listens as a pale-eyed young woman whispers in her ear. One of those the voice spoke of, one of the chosen. The vision fades away. A true soul? Praise be. Are you here to join my hunt? Worshippers of a false god. Their existence is an insult to the Absolute's claim on this region. There is a weapon the Absolute seeks. I'm sure those wretches have it hidden away there. We will find it amongst the dead and the ashes. Her excitement is palpable. She lingers on thoughts of victory, of unbelievers' blood spilled, and of the weapon. She will seize it in the Absolute's name. You feel Shadowheart's anxiety. The weapon the Absolute seeks, it's the artifact that she carries. The same one that protected you as you entered the goblin camp. Her mind focuses. The cultists cannot discover that the weapon they seek is within their grasp. The thief, whimpering in our dungeon, tried to flee to their sanctuary. We will continue to remove parts of him until he tells us exactly where it is. He's been resilient. But he'll talk. She is seeking the grove you visited. Already you feel her mind closing around yours. Speak, true soul. The hunt must begin soon. You would dare! Guards, to me!
Good idea. Take <laughs> Prizes for guessing what this weapon thereafter really is. The artifact. If that's the case, we've got more problems than just the worms in our heads. Now here's somebody special. The Absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you too. 
Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. Maybe you don't need it. After all, you're special, ain't ya? Like me. She probes your mind, tangling your thoughts with hers. A familiar sensation. She too carries a parasite. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. Your minds brush against one another, but are swiftly parted. Don't want to get intimate in front of the novices. Fair enough. Got some weird shadows in your head. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. Of course. Don't want this rabble interfering with true soul business. Let's go to my chapel. Put my head down.
blood comes easy these days. Try me. Don't waste a step. What now? Death won't take me yet. if this is worth the cost. Day No time for mercy.
I'll strike you down. Come on. Can't stay idle. Don't look. 